and then and the symbol and now will be the nurse for today um let me first verify the patient's identity so ma'am can you please state the baby's name a letter in the sapo okay so ma'am i will first explain the procedures to you um Today, I will be performing anthropometric measurement. I will measure the baby's weight, height, the head circumference, chest circumference, and abdominal circumference. It is for us to know and determine if the baby's body is within normal uh, measurement and if to determine if there are some abnormalities with the baby's body. So, let's start first with measuring the weight of the baby. I already placed the weighing scale here in a flat and stable surface to prevent from fall and accidents. So, since I already have washed my hands earlier, let me perform another hand hygiene. And I will put some gloves. Okay, wait for a while. I also have placed already a warm cloth in the weighing scale to prevent the heat of transfer of the baby to the cold surface. So, um, I also have calibrated the weighing scale to obtain an accurate measurement. Okay, so let's start. Let me um, put for a while. So just place. A warm cloth here. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, ma'am, I will first remove all the clothings of the baby so that it will not alter the weight measurement. Mm Okay. Now I will place the baby in the center of the wing scale. Mm -hmm. Since I am using a digital wing scale, I will wait until the digital number is settled on the baby's weight. Okay. So, ma'am, the weight of the baby is 2.9 kilogram. Okay. The normal value for a baby's weight is within 2.5 to 3.5 kilograms. Therefore, your baby has a normal weight. But in some cases, there are babies which in their weight is beyond the normal range. It is a condition due to depending on the mother's food intake while she is still pregnant. So now we will proceed with measuring the height of the baby. So I will be using a tape measurement of the height of the baby. Actually, in uh, measuring the weight of the baby, I need an assistance of another caregiver to obtain the measurement accurately. One will hold the head straight and one will fully stretch the legs baby. But today, since I'm the only available nurse, I will um, just position the baby in a side-lying position to obtain and for better obtaining of the measurement. So I will position the baby in a sideline position. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then I will measure from the heel of the baby to the crown of the head. Okay. Here. The heel of the baby to the crown of the head. Mm -hmm. Okay. So 
the baby's height is 48 centimeter. Uh, mom, the normal value for a baby's height is 47 centimeter to 50 centimeter. Therefore, your baby has a normal height. Now, we will proceed with measuring the head circumference. Since I will measure first the head, I will cover the rest of the body to prevent a hypothermia. Mm -hmm. Okay, now in measuring the head circumference, um, I will place a tape measure above the eyebrow of the baby, at least 2 cm above the eyebrow, um, around the most prominent area of the posterior head. Mm -hmm. So, the baby's head circumference is 33 centimeter. Um, the normal value for a baby's head is within 33 centimeter to 35 centimeter. Therefore, your baby has a normal head circumference. But in some cases, there are some babies wherein the head is bigger than the normal head size. It is a condition called, could be called um, hydrocephalus, wherein there is an abnormal buildup of fluid in the ventricles deep within the brain. Also, ma'am, there are some cases that the baby has a smaller head, smaller than the normal value. It is a case or condition called microcephaly. It is because um, the baby's brain may not be fully developed during pregnancy. So, don't worry because your baby has a normal head circumference. So, now we will proceed with measuring the baby's chest circumference. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, I will measure on uh, the level of the nipple. So, the baby's chest circumference is 31 centimeter. Um, the normal value for a, for a chest circumference of a baby is within 30 to 33 centimeter. Therefore, um, your baby's chest circumference is within normal. Now, I will measure the abdominal circumference of the baby. I will measure the level of um, umbilicus. Okay. Mm -hmm. So the baby's um, abdominal circumference is 31 centimeter. The normal value for an abdominal circumference of a baby is within 30 to 33 centimeter. Therefore, your baby is um, has a normal abdominal circumference. Now we are all done with all the measurement. Okay. Mm -hmm. Your baby. Okay. Let me first summarize and document all the findings. Wait for a while. So, mom, um, the baby's weight is 2.9 kilogram. The baby's height is 48 centimeter. The baby's head circumference is 33 centimeter. The baby's chest circumference is 31 centimeter. And the baby's abdominal circumference is 31 centimeter. Overall, um, the baby's body is within normal um, values. So, the baby is in good condition. Thank you so much. Thank you, Pa. Um, we will set another appointment for the next checkup of the baby. Thank you.